internet. All right. Well, since Santa Claus was the other day, let's just check out this guy. Santa Claus goes on a blind date to find Mrs. Claus. Strange love. TLC. Look at this son of a bitch. Holy fuck. That is what we call a heavy hitter. Okay. Look at that beard, that hair, that translucent red rosacea skin, that nose that goes like this. I don't like people to have that nose that doesn't, that just exposes the entire holes. It's gross. This guy's going to have a hard time finding his wife. Better believe it. I am the real deal Santa Claus. Jesus fucking Murphy. Look how strong Santa is. God damn, son. Can you imagine him fingering your wife? That'd be fucking intense. That's probably the worst thing you could walk into is this guy on top of your wife having his way. But he's really living life. He's living in Christmas world. I mean, nothing's better than Christmas. Okay? I'm not a holiday guy. I'm not one of those people that uh, just can't handle Christmas. I don't, I hate, I fucking hate with a passion a couple things in this world. People that have that constant topic of fucking can't handle Christmas music in stores. Then go, don't go to the fucking store, okay? P burn your ears off. Put fucking chocolate in it and have a fucking ant hollow your shit out. Okay? Because it's fucking just what it is. Who gives a shit? I've never gone into a store and been really that upset about Christmas music going into the fucking speaker system. I know what's going to happen. Okay? Everybody's aware of the holiday, right? Okay, now I can only hope that he's going to tumble down these damn stairs. Because at this point, I wish I had powers to execute his ankles and the strength of them. But, anyways, this guy, I, I don't even know where I'm... I'm getting too excited, okay? Christmas is lovely. I love Christmas. And this guy's... And I only really like the day. Because it's like the only time of year that I actually feel like a little bit of childhood joy. I'm not, you know, every fucking Friday for me is Christmas. I go and buy my shit st stuff all the time. The fuck are you talking about, bro? It's the best part about growing up and getting a job. Buying yourself shit? Pretty sweet. <sighs> fuck it. I, I feel like I'm going to get sick. My stomach's fucked up. I got, like, all this energy pushing up. My face is starting to get red. I feel like him right now. This guy's probably got a constantly steaming, red, like burning face from his fat. I'm looking to find Mrs. Claus. Okay, Something. fix the damn stairs. Nothing's worse than somebody that can't fix their shit. I am shut, shut up. Oh, I just restarted the video. Whoops. Okay, wait. I am the real deal Santa Claus. I'm looking to find Mrs. Claus. Somewhere. I'm curious about this guy's age. I don't think he's as old as he looks. That shit looks died. I don't think he's even Santa. Don't think so. That can stand beside me, have a good time, and live Christmas 365 days a year. That's what I'm fucking talking about. He's got candy cane shirts. He's delicious. Santa no longer uses his birth name. He goes by Saint Nick, Chris Kringle, or Santa Claus. <laughs> I've got a lighted... Holy fuck, dude. This is awesome. Village. When I'm flying around and I've got all... What does he mean he's flying around? Flying what? All the reindeer go... Oh, bitch, please. This motherfucker be in his room smoking salvia devamorum going into the Christmas dimension. This guy's fucking awesome. And I look over the side of my sled. He's over there fucking pulling his pot every night. I, can, I bet you he jacks off like a, no other. And I look down and I see ah! all the houses decorated. Some with snow on the ground, some with cactus. This village reminds me of that. Hell, what part of fucking Christmas is cactuses? That's a warm place that has a cactus. That would be out of place in Christmas town. It reminds me of the scene. Whoa. That see Did you see that part of the town that was going hard? Look at that. It must be the club. This club Santa. Me of that. Look, that's fucking awesome, bro. That's a club right there. That's where all the little elves are fucking splitting their cheeks reminds me of the scene that i see every christmas eve and when i miss that i just go into the room where's all the blacks this guy doesn't like black people at all none of these people are any color than the shade of white walk around and look at it and the memories come flowing back into my mind a lot of people don't understand look at, the, look at that bro that's a nice fucking ass look at the size of this rotund 
rotisserie fucker. Oh my god. I mean, I love a nice pair of pants on a big boy because you can always tell that there's never enough room in a pair of big guy pants. It's always riding up. Splitting into them cheeks, spreading his ass, chocolate kisses everywhere. But Christmas is my passion. Ah! See? Look at that. Go back. Back into my mind. A lot of people Dan don't oh. understand, but Christmas Sheesh! Is Look at this. Can you imagine this? Holding a couple 20s. Couldn't even get it out. My passion. It's my job. It's a joy. And it is really my life. <laughs> if this motherfucker goes out around town like this, 365, he's a fucking legend. <laughs> the physical features of Santa I have. I'm 6'1". I weigh three. Weigh a lot. You better not be lying. You better not say 301. That's a fucking lie. None of your business, pal. Oh, bitch, please. That's what I'm talking about. He's got class. It's like, you know how people don't tell you how much uh, how much they make a year? They're definitely putting a lock and key on how much they weigh, especially this guy. The hair's real. The beard, the mustache. Mm, you know this motherfucker be having that orange hair. This is the type of person that has disgusting ginger hair. That's why he had to take a chain. He had to take a turn in life, make it white. Then nobody will ever know the fucking the past that you lived and are. Eyebrows. Everything's real. A lot of people don't understand, but Christmas is my passion. Mm. It's my job. Where's the kids? This motherfucker's on the hunt right no, now. A lot of people don't understand. Anybody want to help me with my candy cane? Christmas is my Dan passion. Dan and Dan. Hunts. My parents owned a department store in Roswell, Georgia. And mm. when I was sick. Roswell. Aliens. Scene. There's an alien right there. My father called because the Santa had not shown up and I had to be the replacement. So I rushed down to the store and I put on the Santa suit. Oh, this motherfucker never took it off. And I turned around and I looked in the mirror before I walked out. And I he had a full ass erection. I bet he was stiffer than the Dickens. I liked what I saw. This is what my Shut the fuck up. I hate this like kid. Uh, I fucking still looks like that. I got moles and shit. Disgusting. With breakouts along my jawline and my cheeks. Get out of here. And I started walking through the store and people were looking at me and I was waving. Oh, damn it. This motherfucker ain't even gonna wash his hands. Hold on, I'm coming. Hold on, bitch. And you know, I had Look, he's got a bunch of open cabinets, and it looks like there's nothing on the other side. This guy's broke as fuck. An extra Couldn't even finish his cabs. Special you know he'd be living in mom and dad's house. This is a fucking, uh, this is a kid that never left. Killed his parents, too. In my step, I had a twinkle in my eye, and at that point I knew I had experienced the spirit of Christmas and Santa Claus. He's like, come on in, hoes. Oh my God, what's he doing? Are these, are these people in his basement? victims. Hello! 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 How are you? This motherfucker probably be having blood coming out down here. I think he's got issues. His skin's probably very uh, very weak. When Santa walked in, it was awesome. Does anybody have a question? What, what is the North Pole feel like? The North Pole? He's like, this is, this is what it is. Pulls his pants down. Knives. He's got knives in his underwear. It's a very special place. Humans can't see it except on Christmas Eve. But if people fly around, it all looks like snow. We live under the snow caps. Oh, this is, he's talking about conspiracies right now. Under the Antarctic, aliens, reptilians. One of the parts of my life that isn't being fulfilled is my love life. Mm, fucking drier than hell. Santa struggles. No shit. His strict moral code. This motherfucker be jacking off. There ain't no way this motherfucker don't want no sniz. Take him to a club. Let me meet up with Santa. I have chosen not to drink, not to smoke. I don't cuss unless I hit my thumb on a hammer and that's in the workshop. Nobody hears it. Yeah, definitely, bro. I don't want a child seeing Santa Claus going into an R-rated movie. Santa doesn't do that. <laughs> the ladies that I've met up to this point when are probably missing. And they see the strict code. The fuck, dude? That's how he washes his dishes with his wrist. That I have. Pretty clean. They Still some ravioli stains on that bitch. Time to pack up their sleigh and hmm. take off. Hey! Oh, who the fuck is this? Richard. Richard, how are you? Richard's like, God damn it. Why'd you call me over? Good, how are you? 
Yeah. You still have them Xanaxes. You know, he's got mom's pills still up in the cabinet. Come in. Come in. Is it cold outside? Oh, it's cold enough. <laughs> this is good coffee. It is. I pick it up and bring This is some bullshit, bro. He's got some toys down here. Look at that. There's a black guy. About time. Brazil. <laughs> Every year. So, are you dating anybody now? What the fuck's all over his shirt? Santa's got some white stains all over him. I pick it up in Brazil. <laughs> Every year. Yeah. So, are you dating anybody now? Oh, man. You think he's got any girls? Look how small this little joint is now. It's like a little bump. Small as shit. No, not now. And it's a hard thing. I mean, to... Find think. Mrs. Claus. How do you ask somebody out for a date? Yeah, how you, do you add? This guy, I think, has got a little sugar in his tank, if you know what I mean. Uh, find okay. Mrs. Claus. How do you ask somebody out for a date? Usually the ladies will always ask me. Am I, I think them? Richard wants to touch his hair. I think Richard wants to pull them eyebrows back, split his cheeks, put his fucking back into a U shape, go to town. All the nicest. <laughs> always ask that. Uh, Who wants to be in a relationship with Santa Claus? I don't drink wine, don't like wine, but I want milk and cookies. He's like, I'll milk you like no other hoe. I want dessert. I'm not into a lot of the rap and things like that. Who wants to go out and go dancing? And I'm, I'm glad that he brought up that out of everything he could talk about. I'm not into all that rap, okay? It's, it's fucking filth. I don't know the new, what they call it, twerk, tweet. So Man, this motherfucker be watching shows. Don't lie, Santa. I'm going to see Santa's phone. It's probably scarier than hell. Oh, my leg. Who, Ow. Who wants that? Okay, what if I set you up on a blind date? Um... I ain't gonna say no. Blind, <laughs> I'll tell you something. Blind dates always worry me. Like with with who? Helene. Better not be with one of them darkies. This motherfucker, I think, it's got some very strict fucking thoughts and beliefs. Helene. But he be fashion dude. Look at that. He's got some nice cool pants on with some fr uh, flare down here. It's cool as shit. This guy's got some bullshit Merle. Uh, sh these are the shoes he wears every day, too. He'd be thinking he's going hiking, walking down a sidewalk. Yeah. Helene and I were great friends in high school. She was always sweet, nice, wonderful, just very caring. Do you think she'd want to go out with me, really? Of course she'd want to go out with you. Yeah, she's probably in a massive wheelchair, too. So she has no choice if he shows up to even go anywhere. I'll tell you this. If you set me up with Give me the key to her house. Going in. Helene. Right. I promise you, you'll be on Santa's good list. Oh, good. I really need that. You sure do. <laughs> yeah, he does. What's the secret? <laughs> this motherfucker. <laughs> this is not good. This is scarier than hell. This motherfucker, he knows things about Richard that only Richard and him share together. <laughs> <laughs> he wears like children's skins as coats. Cool. Cool. I do not look like I did in high school. I had reddish brown hair. I fucking knew it. Redhead. Freckle face. Gapped buck teeth. See, there he is right there. Probably this one. He had to blur his shit out because it's fucking scary. He's got like a mutant face. Teeth. How the fuck does this bitch not know? Is that her? No, that's not her. Recently, I discovered- Fuck, it scared me. I thought that was her. What is it? Mr. Black. My go-to drink. Coffee. And have to try it. It's called Mr. Black. Great, waking up, drinking on the fucking morning, fucking cruise to work. Real nice. Officers, just black coffee. I'm fucking wasted. Holy reindeer droppings. <laughs> oh, nervous. dude, he's about to go up into the fucking glass blowing shop. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, how you doing, hell? She's in there fucking token a bigger, man. Look at beads, glass, art, blowing, supplies, and dildos, okay? He's never even fucking doesn't even know what this place is. He thought it was an ornament store. He's about to have the world blown in two. Ha! <laughs> Got him! God. I was actually in a fire when I was 13. Oh, that's pretty cool. He's like, oh, you mean the one I started? Oh, were you? So I'm kind My of tits have melt. She probably has no more tits anymore. They're probably melted off that it's just gonna i've planned the worst date ever this motherfucker planned to take her to the crack making play look at her she's hitting the fucking pipe right now getting lit there you go good oh, oh my fuck <laughs> this bitch is like uh god damn it okay, okay she i don't even think she's really even shook by that she's heard a bunch of glass breaking in her life okay yeah you're not afraid of that. 
No. That reminds me. In high school, was your name Hot Lips? <laughs> oh, shit. Santa's out here busting the fucking jokes tonight, dude. He's fucking looking cool as fuck. I've never seen Santa have these type of shades before. <laughs> we're getting along. We're laughing. We're talking. And it just felt comfortable. I had a great time tonight. Did you? Yeah, I had a great time. This fucking puts her face into the flames. That would be awesome. I've never done this before. You're not this going anywhere. It's incredible. I never did have a Christmas tree. You've never had a Christmas tree? Well, I was raised Jewish. Oh, welcome to Christmas. Oh, hell no, bitch. Can't, I gotta go. That motherfucker probably don't even like a Jew ever. Yeah. Oh, you're welcome. <laughs> Christmas outside. Dude, Helen looks like shit. She looks like a zombie. Look at them fucking eyes, man. She looks fucking like the undead. What did he do? Bring the tree? Was that already there? Oh my goodness. This is absolutely incredible. All right, you brought this here? It's like fucking middle of July. This motherfucker's giving her a tree already. Had a tree before. This is a thrill. Let's do it. Can I take your back? Would you? Absolutely not right. very many people get to carry Santa's bag. Oh what God. the fuck is in there, dude? Why did he bring this? Uh, well, you're like a pro. Ho, 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 ho. Oh. Look at him. He's like, oh, Jesus, where's the gun? He's probably got a gun hidden in there. This may work. I'm looking to find my Mrs. Claus. Let's get decorating. I'm ready. Okay. <laughs> so oh, he's going to drag her into it. What the fuck is this? I've never seen him. You know, for somebody that's never had a lady touch him in his life, he's over here grabbing that hand like a champ. I wanted to stand beside me. Have a good time and live Christmas 365 days a year. But you're not really dressed for this. <laughs> oh, this guy is fucking bullshit, bro. She ain't even ready for this. Look at that. She put on her best dentures for this guy. Hell no. Look at them jugs. Santa's packing heat. Damn. <laughs> I've never felt like this with anybody. He's just very calm. And he's just very understanding. She, you know, she's lived a life, too. She looks like she's gone through a bunch of different people, a bunch of different guys hitting her, slicing her up, fucking throwing her against the wall, breaking every family picture and, and throwing it to the flames. Her kids are missing. She needs a fucking spark of hope and happiness, so he's here to give it to her. Tell everybody that you made these ornaments. Oh, my goodness. Isn't that amazing? It was so wonderful to see her hang the ornaments, to get excited. <laughs> Did we do this one? No. That is mine to tell you that you made me feel like a star. Oh, my goodness. That twinkle in her eye, she got it. She gets me. This is absolutely one of the best dates that I've ever had. Wow. So what happens? 